Hello, my name is Mark Coley. I'm on the BMA Sessional Committee and I'm going to show you how to complete a locum A form using Primary Care Support England's portal. So the first thing to do is to navigate to the portal. And then once on the home page, log in. And then navigate to the pensions and payments section and into pensions. The locum A and locum B forms can be found within the locum work section. So we go in there. This is where we'll need to go to enter the locum A form. Locum B forms can be entered here and the listings of all the forms we've submitted previously can be found here. So let's go to locum form A income entry. We need to work our way down from the top of the screen downwards. So pick the pension year that's applicable. Leave this on no. RMS is for Revalidation Management Service. So this is normal local work that I'm doing in a practice. So I leave that on no. This area here will be populated as and when I enter de details further down the screen. So let's say I worked for a couple of days on one, at one practice. So I type in the practice name and find the relevant practice from the list. And then in this section under here, I need to work, put in the dates I worked and the fee associated with those date ranges. So let's say I worked one day in June. Let's put the date in. And let's put a fee in here for that day. Press tab and it will auto complete the pensionable amount from, from my fee. If I worked another day in that same practice, I can just put add another record. Ooh. And then I get to pick a different date. So let's say I worked on the 28th. Then I put the fee in again. Press tab. It auto completes the pensionable element. If I'm happy that that's all the entries I need to do for that practice, I then press save. And then that information pops up at the top with a summary of all, all the totals. And then I can enter details for another practice. So if I worked at this practice on a different date in June, so I can pick the date for that one. Again, put the fee in, press tab, and then press save. So if I did two days at one practice and one day at another practice, we then find in the list at the top the two practices I worked in, the associated fees and the associated pension amount. If I'm happy with that, I tick the box to say that everything is correct, and then I press submit. Locum A forms will be sent off electronically to those two practices, and the whoever's able to authorise those will then authorise them. And then after that, it will be time to complete a locum B form. And there's another video which will show you me doing that for previous month's work.